Well, hello friends, Mark Holmes here, and as always, thank you guys for watching, commenting, and subscribing to the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, man, you know this don't work. It, it don't work without you. It's on, guys. Right now, as I speak, the Dallas Cowboys are on the practice field with our rookies having their first workout. You know, the picture that's the thumbnail that's on here, you see Chris Richard with those young pups as cornerbacks and things and safety. Now, here's what's going to be kind of cool. I love what I heard from Stephen Jones pre-draft. Um, he was talking about how the Dallas Cowboys and the coaching staff are working with the scouting department and Will McClay. That the player types that the team was drafting was changing because of what the input they were getting from Will McClay. Which to me is actually kind of fitting because... For us to go through and get a three technique slash maybe one technique monster in Tristan Hill, to me says a lot because they don't usually value that role very much on the defense, but they're kind of like, you know, maybe we need to. And I think back to what Will McClay did with Seattle. We all think about the Legion of Boom, but you got to understand they had a mean, I mean a mean pass rush and defensive line and a great rotation of people. So you're seeing that kind of kind of happen and start working together now with the team, and it's it's exciting. God, it's an exciting. Oh my God, is it exciting? Man, I, I I I literally could bust. But that's where I think a lot of times people will have a stigma in their mind about a player where he is drafted because we have this whole stigma. Well, you know, Dak Prescott's a fourth round quarterback. Well, yes, he was a fourth round drafted quarterback. And the reason being is, is people didn't see his value. And that happens a lot because you can look and say, well, Paxton Lynch was a number one, you know, first round draft pick. Well, he couldn't bust a great. He came playing the AAF. So where you were drafted has no relevance necessarily how you're going to be. One of the greatest players in the NFL, Deacon Jones, was like a 20 round, 20th round pick. And they coined sack after him and he once had 28 sacks in one season in 14 games but they didn't have it as an official stat back then so forget this whole thing about where a guy is drafted understand the least of boom had only one first round draft pick earl thomas the rest of the guys were fifth rounds or later and even undrafted so you look at these guys that we have, and I got to tell you, Michael Jackson, watch that guy. See, that's the guy that has that size that Chris Richard loves. He likes taller cornerbacks, guys that can hit, guys that can move and things like that. And you watch out. And the other thing I'm sitting here thinking, too, because, you know, the experts out there that, you know, if you listen to the experts, we'd be winning Super Bowls every year, or everybody would be winning Super Bowls every year that said how much we needed a safety. But you know, I think Xavier Woods is on the cusp of actually doing something really special. And I think um, George Aloka, that they've got a lot of faith in him and as well as the competition with Jeff Heath, that I think we're gonna be better shaped than mo most of these people think. So we'll have to wait and see, but this is where it all starts right now. I'm excited, God, I'm excited football. There is no sport like it anywhere 